for, can I ask for, it? Was it was it a knuckle or not? I, I honestly don't know. I was just fucking happy when the ref was walking off, and <laughs> just, yeah, I just you know like that that game that was just crazy. like a, like people want to talk. If people, anyone that was there will tell you that we need more Test rugby league. Yeah, I agree. Like we really do. Like yeah. the atmosphere. Like of all the games I've ever played in, and I don't, uh, well, I don't take this lightly. That's the best atmosphere I've ever played in. Wow, well, even more than GF. Even more than Grand Finals. Wow. Far the right best up. atmosphere I've ever played in. The, the people that came out to support that game yep. was just on another level. Yep. Like, and, and I think looking back, what made it even more special was the fact that it was controversial finish, whichever way you look at it. Um, and like then the behaviour of the fans. Yep. Like, if that's in Europe, in any of the football stadiums, yeah. And a big semi-final is decided like that yeah. against the majority of the home fans. Yeah, that, is that right. referee. Oh, it's a it's a riot. <laughs> that referee is getting death threats. The op, like we're running off with secure. You know, England yeah, yeah. players are running off. Instead, the Tongan fans kept singing. Far out. Like at the end of the game, walking to our bus, they were all congratulating congratulating us they took defeat how you, sh- how you should take defeat wow. yeah, they were disappointed like their players as well they were devastated a lot of us you know like I played with Will Hopper I was, I was devastated for him yeah. like absolutely devastated for him like you know but I was just so relieved that we that we yeah, had the win like, you, you look at sport and sometimes two good teams go up against each other there's got to be a winner there's got to be a loser yeah. we, like, I think Wayne Bennett spoke after the game he said we didn't lo- we only lost that game on the scoreboard today boys yeah like, you guys won the hearts of a lot of people in England. Like yep. you, you won in so many areas. Mm. You just lost on the scoreboard, and that's that's what happens when when two great teams go go against each other, yep. um, and, or two great individuals go against each other. You see it often in the tennis. Yeah, like you know the the big rivalries there. There's not winners, and like the games, the winner. Yeah, like, yeah. You know, you, it you, sounds cliche, but it's a hundred percent true. It's like yeah. Tonga versus like England, mm. the game. Like you, you didn't really talk about the result. You talked about the atmosphere, yeah, yeah, the yeah. moment. The, yeah, you know what I mean. It's that, like that. That's what won. Yeah, like Tonga won that. Way. Yeah, Tonga won on that day in yeah. so many different ways. They yeah. just didn't win on the scoreboard. Yeah. Um. Yeah. You like you, you see it with like great, like all great sport and competitions. You see it a lot in State of Origin. Yeah. Where people like focus like on like the result itself. Yeah. Um. And, and but if we didn't have winners and losers, like there'd be no point in playing. So yeah, and um, like hats off to Australia. Like they, they the defense that they showed was so gutsy. Yeah. Like all teams, like all thirty four players, like were flat out that day. Yeah, like it was yeah. a warm you day, in Br- yeah. warm evening in Brisbane as well. Yeah, like Sankor. yeah, it was, stadium. yeah, it zapped it out. Of, yeah, yeah. every everyone on that field was like put. Like they they couldn't give any more. Like we, they really couldn't have. 